Checking in here. All right, perfect. ID and credit card. How's your night going? Good. How are you? Good. How's yours? Oh, great. Did you work every night? Late I night? Work there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you so much. So is it possible to get some uh, complimentary upgrade? Let me see, Mr. Leo, what we have. Because it's super late, okay? Yeah. Hey guys, this is a quick video about the $20 trick. So I actually tried the $20 trick uh, for the first time at the Excalibur Hotel in Vegas. Um, and I did get a slight upgrade. So here is footage. So is it possible to get some uh, complimentary upgrade? Let me see Mr. Leo what we have, because it's super late, okay? Yeah, well, that's why I asked. <laughs> How was your flight? It was uh, bad. <laughs> No, it, it was just two hours delay, so... Mr. Liu, uh, do you have a preference for two queen beds or a king bed? Um, no, whatever room is better. I, I, I don't really have a preference. They put you on the 28th floor. So five nights starting tonight, leaving on Tuesday the 14th, correct? Correct. As you can see, uh, I was actually... The trick I did, instead of sandwich the $20 bill in between two cards, I did uh, is put the $20 uh, $40 bills uh, in front of my face and just kind of waved at her while I was asking um, about an upgrade. So after I handed her my uh, credit card and my ID, I said, do you have any upgrades available? And make sure that she sees that the dollar bills uh, in front of you uh, and you're willing to give, right? So from this to, um, room type that I have available, I have the staple rooms, and those are the truly newer, uh, more fresher ones that we have. Okay. okay. So let me aim for a uh, king bed. Give me one second. Staple room, you said? Stay well. Stay well room. Okay, so that's the. Okay, I, I know. I have to stay well on those. You don't have any strip view or uh, uh, any view rooms? Let me see. Let me see if I have a strip Okay. And after that, I was able to get a slight, a small upgrade. It is not a, a huge upgrade. We're not in a suite, but however, uh, we were able to uh, be upgraded from the most basic room uh, in Excalibur to the Stay Well, uh, fresh by Stay Well room. Uh, it is a, it's got an air purifier in the room. Also, uh, we are on the strip view, um, so we can see the strip uh, from our room. Uh, now, two factors that you want to uh, take in consideration is first thing, I am an MGM Gold. So it's possible that by default, they're going to give me an upgrade if I ask, even without the $20 trick. Um, the second thing is that I got in at 2 a.m. Uh, so <laughs> the next day I was supposed to, the day after I was supposed to check in, right? So I got in the hotel very, very late. Uh, so they actually might have be running out of room. I actually asked her, do you have, have any suites available? After she said, oh, we can upgrade you to a uh, strip view, stay well uh, room. Um, I asked her, you don't have any suites available? And she said, yeah, no, I, she did look for the suites. So clearly me waving the $40 bill in front of my face definitely sent her a message. So she said she looked, but unfortunately, uh, because I'm here for five nights, uh, you know, she probably can't find a room uh, that is actually available, a suite that's available for that extended period of the time. I got you in a stable king bed overlooking our place, right? Okay, great. You don't have anything better? Like a, like a suite or anything? No, okay. I tried to aim for the suites, but they're fully committed. Okay. We are fully committed for tonight and tomorrow. Okay, okay. It's gonna be a busy, um, B busy, busy, busy weekend. weekend. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. We were, I came in at 5.30, we were sold out by that time. And I was like, oh, Okay. Uh, so your mileage might vary here, um, but keep in consideration. I really think you should try it if you're willing. If you want to try for an upgrade, especially if you're here only for one or two nights, I think the chance is really high. And if you're checking in early, that's that even increases your more uh, your chances, right? If you're checking in early in the afternoon, there might be there might be more room available. So for me, I checked in at two a.m. Uh, in this case, maybe some of the suites are already booked up, uh, giving us free upgrades. So. Uh, hopefully this video helps you. If you want me to do videos of other $20 tricks at other hotels in Las Vegas, make sure you drop a, drop a like and drop a comment. Thank you very much.
One thing I forgot to mention is that uh, after she said she doesn't have a suite available, but she's only able to upgrade to this room, it's, uh, Fresh by State Welsh Review Room. Um, so I had $40 in front of me. I only handed her $20 as a tip, uh, but I appreciated her uh, trying to uh, get me an upgrade and she was happy to get a $20 tip. So she didn't get the whole $40 that I was waving in front of my face. Uh, but uh, just keep in mind, you know, if you don't do the sandwich trick, you have the flexibility, right? Because you still have the money in your hands and people get the hint. You don't have to do the sandwich to hand it to them, to see it, uh, to get the hint. I think people are pretty smart about how uh, the checking desk are pretty smart about uh, when you're asking for upgrades, when you have money in hand, you're willing to give that money away. So they'll, they'll try to help you. All right. Hopefully this helps. Make sure you like and subscribe. Thank you.